But you told me that when we met. Even though I was a little suspicious of this expired Walmart version of I'll Be Sure, he seemed like he knew what he was saying. I'm willing to give it a shot. Me and Rada have a few disagreements, but I love her and I don't want to lose her. Is that you? It's kind of dark. <laughs> what is this? Our first second date, whatever you call it, because our first date was in Arizona. Oh, well, how cute, oh, no, babe. It's off the part of the couch. OK. It's nice soft butt. It's so stupid. Can you take a cut off? OK. I mean, I went out of my way with my champagne and flowers. I made a lot of phone calls to make this happen. I'll have to give you a B minus. So let, let's go back to when we first met. Yeah. When I met her, I had about three side chicks. But she was different. She's the best woman I've been with in my whole entire life. She's caring and loving and so understanding. When we first met, every time we went out, well, I always had some chick with us. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to do a date with our bitches. Just me, you, grapes, champagne. <laughs> Let's toast it, no bitches. How about that? Really? Yes. Tonight. Right? What? Just tonight? I love the fact that he took his time to put this together. But after the meeting with AJ, I'm ready to put my foot down, tell him what I want, and demand more. So what's your point? Of what? Of telling me that. That we are finally alone. I made this happen. I know, but don't you want this more often? You know that regardless of the side bitches, they don't mean nothing to me. Michael's a nice guy. He never says no. So when a side bitch hits him up and asks for a little something, something, he goes for it. If I'm your girlfriend and you don't give a about these bitches, how are you letting these bitches disrespect me in the public? Right before we came here, Michael and I broke up. Michael was seeing the same girl and her feelings start getting attached and trying to question me mentally. And that was not OK with me. I felt really hurt. When these girls just disrespect me, I wish that he can just tell them how it is. I'm tired of looking stupid, you know? Like, if I'm your girlfriend, treat me like your hey. girlfriend. Rada has a point. The side chicks are disrespecting her on social media. I know she wants to be exclusive, but I need these bitches to make me appreciate who you are. Trust me, we both need them. Prior to me, you had a relationship, OK? We were just one-on-one, -on -one, and what happened? It didn't last, because the men were lying. Uh, yeah. honest, right? Right. You agreed to this. We signed a deal, Ryder. We agreed on this. And that's why all I could do is be honest. Whether I'm doing something wrong or not, you will know the truth. That's the best thing in the world, knowing that you're going to know the truth. Ryder probably agreed on this contract because she saw something in me. And she said, you know what? I'm going to hang in with this guy, whatever his issues are, because I see something more with him. I'm then just what? asking for respect, love, and boundaries. I want to change for Ryder. I want to be better. The thing that I really want from you is just some kind of commitment. I can't make any promises right now. Hey, y'all. It's your boy, Caesar, Black Ink CEO. And if you don't know me, the reason why is you ain't subscribed to VH1 YouTube channel. At the end of the day, you already know. That's the number one channel on YouTube. And if you don't got it, I guess you just watch your number two.